If the mean is 30 and standard deviation is given as 8, how many standard deviation above or below the mean is the rating? 52, 22 and 18. So these are three different data given here to find the standard deviation. So general way of doing is with the standardized value which we had now is the standard deviation is given and the mean is given. So mean is given as 30 and the standard deviation is given as 8. So the one standard deviation away from the mean will be 30 plus 8 which is 38 in the upper side and 30 minus 8 will be the lower side. This is one standard deviation away from the mean. And when you consider the two standard deviation away from mean, it's going to be 30 plus 16, that is 46. And the next one is 30 minus 16, which is 14. So this is the general value which we find out, one standard deviation and two standard deviation away from the mean. But now the value is given here is 52, which is neither 38 not 22, not 46, 14. So this is something in between. So we have to find out how much this is deviated. What is the standard deviation of this particular value? The mean is given as 30 and the value here is 52. So find the difference between the two. So 52 minus 30 is 22. That means this 52 is 22 away from the mean. So you have to find the standard deviation. As it is given the one standard deviation is 8. So let us divide this 22 by 8. So when you divide this 22 by 8, the answer is 16 goes 2 times, balance is 6. So 6 again 7 times 56, balance is 4, so 5. So this is the standard deviation. So, how many standard deviation above or below the mean is the rating 52? So, it is 2.75 standard deviation above the mean. Like here we have two standard deviation above the mean is 46 and 52 is something more than 46 therefore it is more than 2 it is 2.75 standard deviation above the mean the same thing we have to do for 22 as we have done for the 52 for 22 when you consider we already have this 22 it is one standard deviation below the mean because one standard above the mean is 38 and below the mean is 22 so as here 2.75 above the mean for 52 and for 22 it is one standard deviation below the mean. So next we will do for 18. So 18 again doesn't come in the standardized value here. So we have to find out. So this again find the difference between the mean and the value given. And this is 12. So this is 12 below the mean value. Divide this 12 by the standard deviation which is given as 8 which is 1.5. So this 18 value is 1.5 standard deviation below the mean. As you have mentioned this is 2.75 standard deviation above the mean and this is below the mean. You can also represent this in terms of 2.75. And below the mean we can consider that as a negative. So you can say minus 1 and the next one is minus 1.5. So these are the three values as for the question asked. So it can be represented by negative instead of saying that it is one standard deviation below the mean. And all these values, suppose we say the mean is given as 30. So instead of 52, if suppose they are asking for 30, the standard deviation is 0 because there is no deviation here. All the values are 30. And you can see that the values are 2.75 minus 1 minus 1.5 as it was mentioned earlier. Whatever be the values, they will be within this minus 3 to plus 3. So the standard deviation, it will be within the 3 standard deviation from the mean. So minus 3 standard 3 to plus 3 it's going to be.